welcome back in last tutorial we got to know about data types in php and today we're gonna talk about variable and constant in php so let's get started with variables simply it is a name or a symbol to hold values in php a variable data type does not need to be declared php itself assign a data type depending upon its values and these are some naming convention all variable in php start with dollar sign Variable name must be start with letter or underscore. It can't start with number and only contain alphabets, number and underscore character without any space. And the way we declare a variable is by first using our dollar sign and then assigning a variable name. So for example, no, number one, then we're gonna set the value to be equal to 10 and semicolon. You know when we are dealing with number we don't need to put quotes so we created a variable of name number and have a value 10 now we can do the same we can create a second variable this time i call it number 2 and value be 20 now we can use the echo and variable name and don't forget to put semicolon at the end now we should have a look on browser so refresh and there is our number 20. We can also combine the variable with a string. So create a variable, number of post, and set that to be 43. Similarly, a variable called name and assign to a string. So I'm gonna call it Marshall. So if user Marshall have created 43 posts. We can print it on browser. So let's do it. Now, echo. Since we are about to print a string, we have to put double quotes. Then name has dollar post. And we can add HTML tags. So I'm gonna do it. Now switch to browser and hit refresh. Here we can see that Marshall has 43 posts. As I mentioned that value of variable can be changed. So create a variable name number 1 and set it to be 20. Then echo the number 1. So now we should get the value 10. Now if you want to change the value of variable number 1, we can reassign the value. So number 1 equals to 20 and echo it now we should get the value of 20 okay we got 20 this is because a program is read line by line so when it gets to line 11 it is said to be 10 and then move to 12 program realized that it is said to be 20 that's why it is printing 20 on our browser Constant is an identifier for a value which can't be changed. And a valid constant name starts with a letter or underscore. Here we don't put dollar sign. To create a constant, define function is used. It takes three parameters in which first two parameters are required, that is name and value. So first of all, we use define function and it takes generally two parameters. A name and a value so define I'll define a name and give it the value Marshall and then put semicolon and save it now echo constant name in our case that is name echo name and save it now switch to browser and hit refresh Okay, we got the value of name that is Marshall in our case. Now let's try to change the value of name. If name equals to let Sudip S U D double E P and save it and switch to browser. It doesn't allow us to change the value of constant. That's why it is showing us an error. It means we can't change the value of constant. 
so in conclusion variable is container to store values and the values of variable can be changed at any part of the script and the constant is identifier for a simple value which can't be changed during the script and we don't need to put dollar sign in constant